And now for my next number, I'd like to return to the to the to the classic. Oh, oh. Times, times, times. Hey everyone, Alex back again. It's been a minute, I know. Uh, normally I don't put a big gap like this in between uh, videos. Actually, that's a lie, because normally I do, but let's leave it. Uh, as if you couldn't tell from the title of this video, this is a contest entry to Clarka Vision's uh, contest. She's having a contest for reaching 400 subscribers and one year in the VC, or at least one year uh, since her first video in the VC, so uh, of course uh, it's all about fours. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, get into this because I want to get. I've got a few more videos to film, so I'm going to try and speed through these. Uh, starting off, of course, with the first question. She's got four questions, all to do with the number four. Let's get into this. So the first question, I have them up there on my laptop. So if I look behind me. Just know I'm looking at the questions. Uh, the first one, though, is the fourth studio album from your favourite band or artist. You probably saw the name of the band on the back cover. It's Arctic Monkeys' fourth studio album, Suck It and See. No secret that they are my favourite band. This was the fourth studio album they released. It was released in 2011 on Domino. Um, the big hit on here is Black Treacle, uh, and Don't Sit Down Because I've Moved Your Chair is also a pretty big song as well. Um, basically, they're my favourite band because I like everything they've ever done, and I'll support them no matter what. Um, pretty bland album cover, but the music's great. So, yeah, that's uh, my answer to the first question. The second question, uh, oh yeah, that's right. An album showing each of the uh, four elements, so fire, water, air, and earth. Um, one came to mind immediately with fire, and that's Leonard Skinner's Street Survivor album. Uh, of course, there is a curse, but I know you probably know the story of behind this cover. They released the album, and I think it was five days after or something like that. They were involved in a huge plane crash where several members of the band died and what have you. Um, I used to see this album with this cover all the time, and then it just vanished into thin air. Um, so I'm glad I have this one to show. That's my answer for fire anyways. Um, for Water, I went with Asia, their first album. There's a big water at the bottom there. Um, I could have also used it for air, but it's mostly clouds and that's not really clear air. But yeah, anyway, for air, I've gone with Super Tramps, Breakfast in America. I could have maybe picked a better one. There is some air there on the cover. Clear cloudy sky, or clear blue skies, so that's my answer for air. Uh, is uh, Breakfast in America. And for Earth, Arcade Fire is everything now. You can see that there. I, another one I could have used for air as well, but no, I decided to go with this. For Earth, that's, that's it. Uh, you can tell I was determined to answer that question, but there's one more question I was even more determined to answer, and we'll get to that one in a minute. But we'll get to the third question first, which was an album um, by an... that an album where the artist or the album cover or the name of the album, I think, I hope, or... Uh, when the name of the song had a four in it and the only thing I could really think of uh, from my collection was Janet Jackson's Rhythm Nation 1814 there is a four in that album title Bev I hope that counts uh, it's the best thing I could come up with um, for my answer to the question uh, hopefully um, you'll allow that one. And 
So yeah, there's that. There's my answer. Now the next one. This was the one I was most determined to answer. Four albums that all contain horses on. Now, Bev, you did say in your video that if we couldn't come up with four for horses, we can include any four-legged animal. But me being me, I was determined to answer this question. And luckily, I was just about able to find four albums in my collection. Uh, well, yeah, four albums with horses on, three from my record collection and one CD. I'll show the CD first. That's Missy Elliott's. Respect M.E. You can see she's clearly riding a horse there. Never listened to that, although it's got all her big hits on it. But yeah, there's a, she's sitting on the horse on the album cover. Uh, so yeah, there's that one. The first one that immediately came to my mind when I thought of album covers with horses on. Bob Seger and the Silver Bullet Band, Against the Wind. Famous cover there from Bob Seger. Had to go with that. Uh, the next one I went with. Foles, Holy Fire. His horse is on that cover. Uh, they're all riding horses on that album cover. This one's not because the horse has horns. Or are they its ears? I, th I, I think they're its ears now. I'm looking at it a bit closer. But everyone else in the background is riding horses anyway. So I'm going with Foles, Holy Fire. And the last one I was able to conjure up with horses on the album cover is uh, Stampede by the Doobie Brothers. Because they are, once again, all riding horses. So, Bev, uh, that's my contest entry. Again, sorry, it's a quick video, but... Uh, like I said at the beginning, I've got a few more videos uh, to make. So, I was speeding through this one. Hopefully... You can enter me. I'm new to your channel through this contest, I'll admit. Um, but I do really like supporting cha new channels, especially uh, new channels to me. Um, I know after a year, um, I didn't have any... Uh, even after one year, I didn't have 100 subscribers. So... Congrats on hitting 400 subscribers after just one year in the VC. I mean, that's a pretty good milestone to be at after your first year. Uh, so with that, that's going to do it for this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to Bev if you're not already. I will leave a link to her channel in the description below. And with that, I'll see you guys again very soon. Peace.